In the previous missions, you've come up with your own movie, creating a storyboard, characters, texts, backgrounds, and made a tripod. You build the set, and now we can start filming. First, you need your tablet. Go to the App Store and look for Stop Motion Studio. Download and install the free version. Start the app. This is the overview with all your projects. You can watch the example movie if you want to. Click on New Movie. You are now on the screen to shoot all the images for your movie. The most important button is the red record button on the right. But before I start, I slide the slider on the left down a little bit. The advantage of that is that I continuously see my previous picture very clearly on the screen. That helps me to remember how much I have to move my characters next. First, I take my title, Beginning Screen. Hold it in front of the lens so the image is nice and filling, and take a picture. Your turn, only record your title screen, or screens. You will see that the pictures you take appear immediately on the bottom of the screen. I now start my movie. I start with scene one. I place all characters and backgrounds in the correct position. Now take the first picture. Now I move my characters a little bit and take another picture. And again, until I have played and recorded the entire scene. For every second of movie, you have to take five pictures. That is the standard setting. If you are maybe going to make a second or third movie later, you can adjust this. If I want text in the picture, remember to leave the text long enough in the image so the viewer of your movie can read it too. If your text takes about three seconds to read, you will have to leave it in the image for about 15 pictures. Now press pause on your video and then, step by step, record the entire first scene of your movie. Once you're done with that, you press play again and I'll show you how you can continue with scene two. Good luck! Did you film your first scene? Beautiful. Maybe you'd already discovered that with the small play button on the right, you can watch your movie. On to the next scene. Actually, it's exactly the same thing. Just place the background, position the characters. And position the tripod with the camera. Make sure it is sturdy. If it's a close-up, then you place the camera closer by. If it's a wide shot, then place the camera further away. Make sure again that everything is nicely positioned, filling the screen. Now, step-by-step step, record all scenes of your movie. Keep your storyboard handy to check that you don't miss anything. Good luck! Did it again? Great! That was the recording of your own animated movie. In the next and last mission, we are going to edit the movie and add sound. See you then!